Hey, what's up everybody? This is a, sort of a vlog. Uh, this is just to show you. Uh, basically, I've been doing a lot of cleanup in my collection and one of the processes of that is I went ahead and removed all of the empty uh, sprues from my uh, Gundam model kit boxes and this is the result. Uh, it's approximately, I would say, about 40 kits worth of sprues uh, from these, you know, Gundam model kits. And, uh, yeah, that's a lot of, uh, a lot of plastic. I'm hoping I can find a place to recycle this, because that would be the great thing to do, is just recycle it all. But, yeah, these are, you know, basically uh, trash bags full of these plates, all the way to the top and overflowing. Uh, so that's a lot of Gundam model kits, a lot of money spent on Gundam uh, model kits. And uh, I'm trying to cut down. Uh, if you've been watching my channel for at least a year or two now, you know that... Uh, I haven't been re reviewing a lot of the Gundam model kits like I used to in my first couple years of uh, YouTube reviewing. I uh, just kind of, I still watch Gundam reviews, I still build the kits, I just don't have the uh, time or the interest anymore to actually go ahead and review them. Uh, I have a couple I might review, but um, not as often as I did in the past. So as part of the cleanup process, this is the result here of my uh, um, leftover Gundam model kit sprues. Now over here are all the box boxes. What I've done is I've taken the top part of the box which has all the nice artwork on it and I'm actually going to save these and store these somewhere. This is like I say about roughly 40 kits uh, varying from high grades to no grades to master grades and one thing I love about Bandai model kits is they have fantastic artwork like I mean just imagine this hanging on a wall somewhere. What I'll do is I'll probably cut off the four sides and just have the uh, you know the the main top part of the box as a kind of a poster and uh, you know fantastic artwork uh, I just didn't feel like throwing the uh, box art away I threw the uh, other part of the box away of course but uh, this part I wanted to keep really cool I love especially the I'd say the double O Gundam uh, artwork is the best there's a Cerevi Gundam, that looks awesome. That'd look fantastic on a wall somewhere. Really cool. This looks pretty cool as well. But, you know, I'm not going to go through all of them, but you, you, know, you get the idea. These are just the tops of the boxes. And, uh, that's a lot of kits. A lot of money I spent on Gundams. Uh, model kits. So, yeah, like I said, um... My main interest as far as uh, toy collecting and hobby collecting is is Transformers. Transformers and Gundam have always been main interests of mine, but uh, lately, in the last year and a half or so, uh, I've been really into Transformers a lot of the time. Um, with the you know the, the Transformers Prime line of toys and just the the third party stuff being released for Transformers has really um, got a lot of my attention and a lot of my uh, time and uh, money. So. Uh, but like I say, I'll still be watching Gundam reviews. I'll still be, uh, you know, building the kits. I just won't be building as many as I have in the past, and, and I won't be uh, reviewing as many as I have been uh, in my first couple years of, of YouTube reviewing. All right, so this has just been a vlog to show you what I've been up to, and I will probably post a collection update uh, to show you what I've been doing in my collection room. All right, catch you later. And thanks for watching.